Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today we will be filming uh, basically Hailey Bieber's tutorial that she showed on TikTok. I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys have seen it. If not, go check it out. She does a really amazing job on her makeup and it's very natural, uh, very simple, not too much makeup, just how I like to apply my makeup. So I'm very excited about this video. So let's jump right into it. But before, if you guys do enjoy this video, feel free to like my video comment down below any questions that you guys might have also subscribe to my channel that would be awesome if you guys want to see more of me you can follow me on my social media under daniels5 on tiktok twitter instagram so feel free to follow me all right let's go ahead and start now i don't have a lot of the products that Hailey bieber was using in the video but i do have very similar products so i'm gonna try to try my best to basically get the same look with the products that i have okay so she began with vitamin c the vitamin c that i have um, is a sample from herbivore i'm not sure if you guys have heard of this brand this is their vitamin c i guess it's a brightening serum so this is what we're going to go ahead and use this is this was her first step and i've used this before i like the consistency i just don't like how it smells it smells like turmeric but i mean it goes away it's very light it's cooling on the face um it spreads easily on the skin. It feels very velvety. Okay, so now that we've applied the vitamin C, let me see what else she does after that. So she uses another moisturizer. Me, this is def definitely not how I would do my makeup. I hardly use any moisturizer because I'm very oily, but we're gonna go ahead and follow the way she does her routine. So the moisturizer that I'll be using is a new one from Summer Fridays. It is the dream oasis deep hydration serum i've used this before it's beautiful it's very lightweight um so it's perfect for my oily skin so i'm gonna use about two pumps of that this has no scent which i like okay i've applied the moisturizer now um the next step in her routine was sunscreen the sunscreen that i will be using is the super goop glow screen so i'm gonna put a about a dot my forehead another dot on my cheek and then one on my nose now if you guys haven't used the glow screen from super goop it's a beautiful formula it does have a tint to it it's very glowy um, it smells it smells like SPF but it's like very light um, I actually enjoy the scent of SPF. Doesn't I don't mind it. Okay, so I've applied the sunscreen and this is definitely not how I do uh, my routine when it comes to doing my makeup because this is very glowy, I'm heavily moisturized, and again, I have very oily skin, but my skin is looking really nice right now. It feels good, it feels very dewy. So the next step is she uses the Kosas Concealer, which I do have. I have it in the shade 4.5. I swear by this concealer, I love it. Now, I just forgot how she applied the concealer. I want to apply it the same way she did, so let me look at the video. I'll be right back. Okay, so I just saw the video how she applied it, and she basically goes a little bit under the eyes. And then she does three dots going up and then she does some on the sides of her nose the middle of her forehead and that's about it this is the sephora 71 concealer brush and yeah let's go ahead and start blending Okay, I'm done blending the concealer. Her next step is applying a berry tone blush. What I will be using today as the berry tone blush will be the Lip Suede from Westman Atelier. Um, this compact comes with four different colors. The closest berry tone that I see similar to what she used would be this one right here. And what I like to do with any blush, I first apply it on my palm of my hand, rub it, and then I'll go in on my cheeks 
just so I don't over apply. She puts it on her cheekbones. And she goes very far back with the blush. She also applies some on her nose. Okay, then she goes in with a brow gel. I don't have a brow gel, but what I do have is the Anastasia Brow Free, so that's what I will be using for today. She doesn't go too heavy handed. And so basically, I'm just gonna run the product very quickly. She didn't focus on too much on her brows. Okay, so I'm done with the brows. Then she goes in with a cream highlighter. She says she only likes to use cream highlighters. And the one she was using was from Tom Ford. What I will be using for today is um, Westman Atelier again. And this is in the shade Parla. This is limited edition as well. It also came in that with that lip suede. It was a Christmas set. Very expensive, but worth it. So this shade is a very champagne-y uh, highlighter. So what I like to do when I apply my highlighters, again, put it on the palm of my hand. And where she applied her highlight was on her cheekbones. And she also applied some on the bridge of her nose. Okay guys, so I'm really loving this look. It's looking very nice, very dewy. Again, it's not something that I would do because again, I'm very oily, but let's continue. So the next step, she goes in with an eyeshadow. I don't own eyeshadow because I don't use eyeshadows. I never do in my makeup routine, but she uses a, a powder eyeshadow. So what I'm gonna use is the Victoria Beckham Bronzing Brick as an eyeshadow. Um, she did use something similar to her skin tone, so I'll be using the lightest one on this uh, Bronzing Powder Duo. And I'll be grabbing it from this side. And she doesn't go too heavy on the eyeshadow, so I'm gonna do the same thing. The next step is she goes with lips. I typically don't use, she uses a lip liner and then I believe Pillow Talk from Charlotte Tilbury. I don't use really lip products. I'll lip, use like a tinted lip balm. I will be using the Dior Lip Glow in the shade 20. This is the mahogany one. This is the one that sells out very quick. Love this one. I've had it for a year now and it's lasted me pretty well. So I'll, I'll use a little bit of this because again, I don't really like to use any lip color on my lips. Okay, so the next step is she uses powder. The powder that I will be using is the Charlotte Tilbury powder. This is in the shade two, shade medium. She does use the Laura Mercier uh, powder. I don't own that one. So we're gonna go in with the Charlotte Tilbury. And she applies very minimal powder as well. Okay, so that was the final step. And honestly, this look, I really do love it. It's right up my alley. It's very minimal. It looks very glowy, very dewy. Um, love the color she uses for her blush, how she applies her concealer. I love how minimal the makeup is. Um, love how little product she uses on her brows. Just, I really do like this look and I feel like I definitely see myself using it again. All right, guys, but that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please like my video, comment down below any questions you might have. I will be listing everything that I use in the description box. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also you guys can follow me on other social media like TikTok, Instagram, and Twitter under the name of Daniels5. See you on the next video.